Welcome to Welcome to Baking with Buddha. And today we're gonna be baking cookies. So today we're gonna be baking Pillsbury. Oh god, sugar cookie dough. Oh okay, it's you're gonna be making cookies out of the dough. So it's okay. I thought you were gonna be making cookie dough. So first we gotta ring the Buddha bowl. Ready to cook. Alright, so we don't have katanas, so we're gonna have to settle with some kitchen knives. We're gonna wanna cut these in half inch slices. So one booty chop. Ah. Ah. And you're ready to cut. Okay. So you're gonna wanna cut these. I don't know how long a half inch is. I don't have a tape measure or a ruler, so just gonna wanna eyeball that. To about those size, uh, you know, the hands are clean because COVID and just sanitary reasons in general. So, you know, it's okay to have these and you're going to bake off the germs anyways, you would hope. So yeah, two booty chops, three booty chops, four booty chops. And you know, get these uh, about this size. Then, when you have all your pieces cut up, you can put them on the tray. So, you can use foil. You can get this at any kind of store. Grocery store, Kmart, Walmart, I don't know. Probably just get it on Amazon. But, put them all out here. You kind of want to spread them out evenly so they don't touch. Not because they have COVID or anything or germs, but because you don't want them to stick together. And you want, Unless you want some like, I don't know, special cookie that's stuck together. Like a Siamese twin. I don't know, whatever you'd like. So. We're gonna put these in the oven. It says 350, but we're gonna jack it up to 450, a whole hundred degrees higher. That's some simple math for you. And you're gonna wanna bake them, not like a dog or a cat, but like cookies. So you're gonna wanna leave them in there for an extra couple long minutes and we'll be ready to eat. Now that the oven's ready, we can throw in the cookies. Ooh, let me get my hat on straight. I'm gonna throw them in the middle rack, cause, I don't know equal to all sides of the rack, up and down, sideways. And we're gonna set this for, oh wow, I didn't even check the timer before I threw away the wrapper. Well, it's unsanitary to get the wrapper out of there, so we're gonna go with, I don't know. If you don't get the wrapper out of there, it's in the mouth. The wrap, no, the wrap, never mind. The audience is talking back. <laughs> we don't do this shit on Baking with Buddha, we have a quiet audience. Okay, we're gonna go with the, uh, I don't know, eight minutes. And now that the cookies are done, oh God, they're still molded together, Jesus Christ. They're not done, gotta throw them back in. Oh wow, these look delicious. As you can see, they molded together into some kind of mutated cookie clump monster thing. It's like the blob, but in cookie form. So you're just gonna wanna get your spatula right there. Oh wow, that one came off. Now. Oh. Oh wow. And it's okay if the cookies fall apart because you know they'll probably just fall apart in your stomach anyways when the stomach acid dissolves them. So really, it all ends up in the same place. Am I right? Ha 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 ha. God, I feel like. This is how fake people sound on TV. Like, not Rachel Ray, cause she's cool, but maybe Emerald. Paula Dean. What a riot she is. <laughs> oh, wow, look at these cookies. Mmm. And because it's baking with Buddha, we add a little cool sprinkles on here. What? I know, wow. Wow. And there you have it, folks. Pillsbury sugar cookies. Oh, mm.